for how long do y'all think I've had these braids in? Oh my God. <laughs> Y'all see all that Negro, oh my goodness. And this is all my hair, like no weave added. So we'll see how it looks. what's up fantastic people so i've had these braids for a long time i'll insert a picture of how my braids looked when i originally got them done and let me know how long do you think i had these braids one month two months six months three months just let me know in the comment section but i'm gonna take my hair down this is all my hair no weave added um literally have not had my hair <laughs> um washed or blown out or anything since i got this done um and of course my child has to be in the camera like it just has to be um but yeah i'm gonna wash my hair deep condition it i'll probably give myself a few different treatments um because like i said it's been a while since i've given my hair some tender loving care and i'll do like a lymph check because i got it cut before i got it done maybe a month or so before i got my hair braided but yeah and basically the way they did it was they connected each braid so there was only one braid left but yeah let me know what you think in the comment section how long have i had these braids i'm not gonna be offended trust me I had braids for ooh, i think a little bit over two months but it has been uh, over three months since i've had my hair washed conditioned anything um i went to the salon um, end of July, the day before my birthday, to get my hair done. And since then, I have not had anything done to it. So, the the last clip um, where you see me with my braids, and I'm saying I'm taking them out. Yeah, that didn't happen that day. I just didn't have the energy to take them out. So, it's actually been over a week since that time. Finally took my braids out. It took me forever. I had so much hair that, you know, shed it from the braids. Came out when I was combing. But this is my little fro. What I plan to do is give myself a deep conditioning treatment. And I'm going to do a bentonite clay mixture also. Because I couldn't quite get to my stylist um, so that I can get my hair washed and trimmed professionally so I'm gonna have to you know make it do what it do at home but yeah stay tuned for the rest of the footage so happy my stylist was able to squeeze me in but this is me getting my hair done after not being to the salon in months so I have two clips here the first clip so the, on the lower screen is when I had my hair done for my birthday. This is after the hydration treatment. And the upper clip is me right now. Check out the difference. Now my hair is freshly blow dry. My hair felt so good. Like getting your hair done is like a massage like no other. When I say it's so therapeutic and so relaxing. But my hair felt a lot better after this wash. So I'm super glad that I was able to get into the salon so that she could hook me up. But I'm gonna show you the growth that I've had in my hair over the last few months from the last time I've had it done. So I'm gonna insert some clips. This is right now. I did not get a trim this appointment because I didn't need one, but next time I go, I'll have to get a trim. But in the next clip, I'm gonna show you how my hair looked back in July when I got it done. So this is right before she actually cut it. This is after she's blow dried it, after she's pressed it and trying to figure out what length I need to get cut off. But that was my new growth from the no heat, low heat that I had been doing. And here we go for the final product. Definitely love how my hair felt and feels. Um, I generally will get it bumped or curled because when I wrap it, I want it to maintain some body. But voila! Thanks guys for watching this video. Make sure if you're not already to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and share this video so that you can stay tuned to my low heat, no heat 12 month journey.